Greetings, beloved of my father. Welcome to the most exciting cooking show on this planet Earth. The name is The Kitchen Pulpit. Yes, we are ministers of good food, healthy food, because our payoff line says uh, health wealth. And we are so excited because the minister of the good food, of the healthy food, and the tasty food is none other than my guru wangu. And we call her a chef as well as Mfundi Zigogo Rodzi. Uh, welcome to the show. What do you want to say to our viewers? Welcome our viewers. We are going to have another well enriched food. <laughs> <laughs> One thing I like about my, my guru is everything is enriched. No matter if even if it is organic as it is, but when it comes, it comes clothed enrichment. So what are we making today? Two gazerichi my Today we are going to prepare chickpeas stew. But it is going to be accompanied by brown rice uh -huh. that is fried. And okay. enriched as well. <laughs> and ka pasaid pachupanin panika okra. Ka okra. Yeah. Wow. If you don't know what okra is, okra <laughs> is that delicious, a delicious, delicious within a delicious meal. So I can't wait to see what it is that we are going to do. So maybe let me just uh, ask, what is the uh, nutritional value of a brown rice? Okay. Brown rice, you know. Mm -hmm. When Makonda used to choose the white rice, yes, yes. but the brown rice originally was packed with vitamin B complex. Okay. The B complex, I can never move it. You nervous system, digestion, and all those things, but we are missing it. So I got to go down to the rice and get to get brown rice. Okay. Then in a starch as well is in a carbohydrate. I got to make it. I just need it. If your desire is to learn of how you can make tasty, healthy foods in your home under the banner of Ndawayango, my place in Jimboyango, do as I am going to do. I'm going to sit back, relax, and listen, watch every step so that I can make the chickpeas in brown rice with a bit of kadelele right yeah. on the side. <laughs> well, we can't wait to see what you're doing, so you can take the reins. Okay. Okay, as we said in our introduction, as we become punga, mchuku, brown rice. When we come under that genre, we go to white rice. But white rice are not nutrient value. We need to touch it. But brown rice, there are nutrients. I don't even know where. I change to our B complex, B one, B two, niacin, tinoada, pamoviri. Besides, we go on a simba. So that we are bigger. Not only the traditional way attack a jaira, but that we add the value. Kuti we add the kuti pa many nutrients that are in order. So that shy add the that that we fry. Twice we boil. So that what we we'll do, we need spring onion. We are going to chop a little bit the garlic. Then we are going to fry. We are using just one cup. And then we just need one tablespoon of our olive oil. After having it crispy, you add your garlic.
for the chickpeas. We soaked it overnight and then we have boiled it. One and a half a tablespoon oil is enough for the chickpeas that I'm going to prepare. Then I'll add half cup chopped onion. Then I'll also add half cup chopped red pepper. Then I'll also add half cup uh, chopped green pepper. I'll add half a tablespoon of finely grated um, beetroot. So Michael, when my son sees something extraordinary, he says, I'm a zing. I don't know what that means, but this looks I'm a zing. Um wow, chickpeas. Mm -hmm. And I love the way that you have plated it. Do I go straight into the rice, the chickpeas? Can I leave the butternut for now? Because I really want to test the, the chickpeas. Why? Well, indeed, this is what we do on the kitchen pulpit. We transform uh, things that you know ordinarily to look extraordinary. So what else do you want to say to our viewers before we quick can conclude our session for today? Okay, for when you are serving such a dish, the only thing that is missing is something that is raw. You can start off with your salads. There you have it. Is it your desire to transform any organic ordinary ingredient into an extraordinary plate just like we did here so don't hesitate follow the link below for this and many other recipes from all of us here on kitchen puppet we say god bless you and join us on our next episode